Well, hello everybody and welcome back to the Rock and Reaction Rollers where we react to music that we grew up with from the 60s to the 90s and my name is Tammy. <laughs> okay, it's Tuesday night so <clears throat> if you're new to the channel and um, if you haven't noticed we've had quite a few subscribers in the past week or so so welcome aboard everybody and it won't take long to uh, figure everything out. Um, so if you have any questions you can just put it in the comments or you can email me or whatever if you're new to the channel and you want to know about something um, or there's plenty of people out there that'll help you you just got to jump right in and just comment and and um, just join the little rock and roll family that we have going on here but tonight is Tammy's two for Tuesday so this is the night that I play two songs and sometimes um, well I have been doing like two from one artist but like Karen mentioned the other night that you know, there's tons of possibilities and things I can do um, with that. So we might next week mix it up a little and do a couple one-hit wonders or, you know, just two of something, some kind of category. So I'm going to try to change it up a little bit after tonight. But the reason I'm going to do the two tonight that I'm going to do is because of the eclipse that we had yesterday. I wanted to get this song on. My boss had mentioned that I should play this on the channel for the eclipse, and uh, I didn't get it out yesterday. So... I'm going to play it tonight, and then I also really love one of the other songs that this person sings as well as one of my favorite songs from back in the 80s. So um, the one I chose, the artist I chose, is Bonnie Tyler, and um, so her real name is Gaynor Hopkins Sullivan MBE. And if you don't know what MBE is, because I didn't, now Mark will know across the pond. It's a British honor that is awarded to a person by the king or queen for a particular achievement. MBE is an abbreviation for Member of the Order of the British Empire. She was awarded an MBE in the Queen's Birthday Honors for Services to Music. So, I think that's cool. So, anyway... Yes, you've ch picked the song or you know what it is by now. We're going to go back to, oh gosh, I think this one is 1983, I believe. I don't know why I didn't write it down again. 1983, Total Eclipse of the Heart by Bonnie Tyler. So we're just going to get right to it.
thing I can do A total eclipse of the heart Once upon a time there was light in my life But now there's only love in the dark Nothing I can say A total eclipse of the heart song for a minute it's a pretty long song <clears throat> but I never realized how this song actually touches every emotion you have out there I think <laughs> um, it means a little more to me now than it did back um, in 1983 which is I, when I believe the song um, was released uh, but I didn't have it written down but anyway it's just one of them ballads that just kind of hits you no matter you know, what you might be dealing with in your life, it could be taken a lot of different ways, and so, a uh, great song, but I've always loved Bonnie Tyler's uh, voice, her raspy voice, and we're going to talk a little bit more about her after the song, but I do want to say a couple songs. This song was her biggest hit, um, and it came off the Faster Than the Speed of Night album, so we're just going to get right back to it. Again, if you're here tonight, you're uh, here for Tammy's Two for Tuesday, we're playing a couple songs from Bonnie Tyler, and the first one is Total Eclipse of the Heart, and so we're just going to get back to it. And I need you now tonight, and I need you more than ever, and if you only hold me tight, we'll be holding on.
Wow, pretty powerful song there. <laughs> uh, <clears throat> that woman, though, her raspy voice, she, she not only, I mean, she's got such control of her voice that she can make it raspy, but she can also hit those high sweet notes, too. It makes the song sound like, she sounds like a bird she's singing and, and just beautiful tone and all that in her voice. Um, but uh, anyway, I actually kind of forgot about Bonnie, Bonnie Tyler. Um, and so it, when my boss said something about this song when we were talking about the eclipse the other day, I'm like, oh, she's one I got to put out there because there is another song that I like even more than this one. Um, which we're going to play next, which is actually probably my favorite one from her. But anyway, let's talk a little bit about her here. Um, it says, okay, she is a Welsh singer who is known for her distinctive husky voice. Tyler came to prominence with her release of her 1977 album, The World Starts Tonight, and its single, Lost in France and More Than a Lover. Her songwriter and producer, Jim Steinman, wrote this song, Total Eclipse of the Heart. The lead single from her 1983 Faster Than the Speed of Night album. He also wrote her 1980 hit, Holding On for a Hero. In the 1990s, she had success in mainland Europe with Dieter Bowley, when, who wrote and produced her hit, Bitter Blue. Okay, and then going back to her early life, she quit school at 16 and went to work in a grocery store. And then in 1969, she entered into a local talent competition by her aunt. And she came in second to an accordionist, which inspired her to become a singer. She first found work singing as a backup singer for Bobby Wayne and the Dixies before forming her own band called Imagination. In 1975, she was spotted singing with her band in the Towns Band Club by talent scout Roger Bell, who invited her to London to record a demo track. After many months had, had passed, she received a phone call from RCA Records offering her a recording contract. They recommended she change her name, and that's how Bonnie Tyler came about, because her real name is Gaynor Sullivan now, but it was Gaynor Hopkins. Um, but she's been married to um, her husband, Robert Sullivan, since 1973. So they've been together, what, 51 years. <clears> or <throat> getting close. So, wow. <laughs> but what an amazing voice. And um, so I hope you guys enjoyed it as much as I did. And, um, again, I hope a lot of you got to see the eclipse yesterday. It wasn't a total one for us, but it was 90%. Um, but back in 2017, we seen the total one, but it was still kind of cool. It was still kind of cool. It got about 10 degrees colder, and just everything looked weird, um, kind of like in the twilight zone a little bit. And our rooster started cockadoodle doodle, but that was about it. <laughs> so anyway, I'm gonna get off here so we can get through the night. Um, I did put the list of birthdays out earlier, if you haven't noticed. So go check them out. Tomorrow night we will not be on the channel. We're gonna put one more song out tonight. So be sure to tune back in here in a little bit and peace out.